Just as an astronaut must study the physics of outer space in order to survive, so too must a psychonaut be well versed in the landscape of inner space. This is from the first line of chapter six of my new book, Topography of the Inner Worlds, the Inner Landscape of Consciousness, which is the whole goal of this book. My new tome that I spent a couple of years working on called Shubhanak Kabbalah, a mystical path to uniting the tree of life and the great work. The goal is to make as comprehensive as book as possible for anyone to be able to pick up and understand what mystics throughout the ages have been talking about for eons and their experiences in these invisible realms of consciousness, this transcendental space of mind and and matter or even beyond matter uh, that we too can navigate and experience as our mystics in our own right. So today is day eight of my 10 day countdown to my book launch on December 8th. Um, I'll be holding a party at Aquarius Books in Kansas City, Missouri uh, from one to three celebrating my launch. I'll do a little bit of reading for my book. I'll do a little presentation. Uh, we'll all have snacks and all kinds of stuff. So the reason why it's 10 days is to represent the 10 sufferot of the tree of life. The 10 sufferot are the 10 emanations of consciousness in which creation has begun from its inception to where we're at now, to what we're experiencing right here in this mundane reality or regular reality, whatever you want to call it. And Day eight, it represents the eighth sephirot on the tree of life, which is Hod. Hod is a splendor. It represents splendor, the splendor of intellect, which is where the forms within the astral plane really begin to uh, concretize so that they can become manifest into the world. And by forms, I mean ideas that are turning into symbols or some other, some, some other form of manifestation which will reveal itself in the manifest world. The best way to understand this is language or mathematics, where we take arbitrary or nebulous ideas that are in our brain that don't yet have form and we bring them into form in order to communicate with one another and in the world around us. So I am honoring the Sephiroth of Ho today with this video and understanding that this is my eighth day countdown. There'll be a lot more content on the way. If you could please or pre-order my book at Llewellyn.com or Amazon or Barnes & Noble, any one of these venues. If you order from Llewellyn, you may get it sooner rather than later, just FYI. Regardless, if you pre-order my book and send me an order confirmation, I will send you some supplemental material that is exclusive only to you that have pre-ordered my book. It's called Pooh, Shamanic Kabbalah Pooh, which is pre-order offerings. And I've created a lot of new extra content that will help augment your experience of reading this book. Extra ritual practices, meditative practices, um, all sorts of guides for extra materials that you may want to look into because this really, one book can't be your source for experiencing not only just the entire worldview of shamanism, but also of Kabbalah. So, thank you very much for all of your support. Please go out there and order my book. I've provided links um, into this video. Love you all very much. Take care. Have an awesome weekend.